Welcome, welcome. Hi, my name is Wendy Literal with Creation Depot, and today I'm going to be going over how to get your tools back and your panels back and everything else that suddenly disappeared in Illustrator. I recently did a video on this very same subject with uh, Adobe Photoshop. It is the same across the entire Adobe suite, but I thought I would go over here because some people are searching for Illustrator and some people are searching for Photoshop. So I'm sorry if this seems like a little bit of a repeat, but um, it's just a different set of people. So the quick answer is, is that you probably just hit your tab key. I'm serious. Just hit the tab key on your keyboard. It's all back. <laughs> so if you just suddenly disappeared, that's all it is. So hit your tab key to make it go away. Hit your tab key to bring it back. And so now you just got to stay tuned to see the other reasons that your toolbars might have actually gone away. <laughs> So the benefit for doing it this way, they're not trying to make you go nuts, is that it's a lot easier to just showcase and see what you're working on without a whole bunch of tools, like if you're trying to work on a piece of art. So that's why they made it quick and easy. Um, if you hit your F key, it has another form of shadow boxing where it makes it, everything go away, it makes it full screen, and you can cycle through the different options there. Um, that's really all there is to it. I do want to go over some other options if this is not your problem. Like you have your toolbars, but say you are missing your layers panel. I'll do layers. Everyone does layers, but that's that's the most common one. So what you want to do is you go up to windows and you go down to layers and there it is appears. You can also hit the F7 key and that brings it back to there's a lot of keyboard shortcuts. Um, I've never bothered to really learn the shortcuts because I find that once I have my tool set up the way I like it, I, I just leave it open. And on that note, there's something else called a workspace. So if you're up here and you go to windows, go to workspace, you can choose some like pre made out ones. Um, like if you're an illustrator and you want to use painting, um, another one, I think there's, uh, yeah, it's a website. I have never used illustrator to design a website. <laughs> I think I would go nuts if I tried to do it in illustrator. Um, but yeah, there's, there's already some, there's a whole bunch of presets and, like I said, I have found myself to use the essentials and I just modify it the way I want it and leave it that way. And you can actually create a new workspace. So once you've got things the way you like them, you can go create a new workspace and save it. And the benefit of saving it is that if you find that you have to work across multiple machines, like let's say you have a home machine and a um, at the office machine, a work machine, you can export these things and take it with you so that you have the same setup everywhere you go. So that's it. That's all I wanted to share. Um, again, tab key is probably the problem you're having. But if you are missing a particular panel, you're going to go to window and then go find the panel that you're missing. So that's it. I hope this is helpful. I hope that it was just the tab key and that's all you were looking for. And it was a quick and easy fix. If this helped you out, I do appreciate likes and subscribes and mostly comments. And you can just say thanks, Wendy, in the comments. I'll be so happy because it makes YouTube happy and it does help me grow my channel. So that's it for now, guys. Take care. See you later. Bye.